so it's just coming up to half past four and I've just left work after another long day. Nice early shift, managed to book that in advance so I can get out and get up to um, Upton Park as soon as possible. I was on Radio 5 a little bit earlier on today and I have to admit I wasn't really feeling too sad about it but after hearing what uh, Brian Williams was saying and after actually just talking through it I've got to say I'm feeling a bit sad now, mixed emotions really. It's going to be great to get to Olympic Stadium but equally it's it's going to be sad to say goodbye to a, a stadium that I've been going to now, me personally, for, for 10 years. Shame about the weather, really, and uh, let's hope that West Ham can get a positive result and that we can actually send off the boating ground in, in, in the manner that it deserves. So yeah, here we are, Waterloo Station. Done this route to Upton Park so many times. The beauty of this one, though, so I got a copy of Blown Bubbles monthly to keep me occupied. I have to say actually, it was probably putting together this last issue of Blown Bubbles that actually made it even more real for me. You know, we've had such a fantastic season uh, this season under Slavin Bilic. You know, it's a great first season. Dimitri Payet, Manuel Azzini have done so well this season. And actually, it's kind of distracted me from the fact that we're going to be leaving the bowling ground and now putting this issue together and right now it's become very real. Definitely. The one thing that I wish that I did have on today, which I don't, is a, is a West Ham colours of any sort. I'm still kind of, as you see, shirt, shoes, trousers. You do get on midweek games, don't you? People turning up that normally we'd be wearing like full West Ham kits and all of a sudden they're wearing a, a suit and tie. So, a bit disappointed about that. I should have really brought a shirt in. But hey, do you know what? Today's about what's on the pitch, not necessarily what's, what's off it. So, yep, here I am. West Ham, and I've got to admit, this is probably the one thing I won't miss about leaving the bowling ground, the change at West Ham to, uh, to get the tube up to Upton Park or Plasto, but yeah, already quite busy, as you can probably hear, quite a few chants of irons already. Here we are, Upton Park, for the very, very last time. Do you know what's sad? I wonder what they're going to do with that sign. They're going to have to take that down, aren't they? Um, I hate that journey, changing at West Ham, and I had to run for the train as well. Normally, I'm a bit more smart. I end up going towards the front of it. You get to all the gates quicker and to the pub quicker, but um, couldn't, didn't have that option today because I had to run for it. So the train was quite quiet, considering that it's only West Ham people about, but on the station already, there's loads of West Ham fans posing for pictures as... You can probably see just there all taking advantage of having that picture with the Upton Park sign. Uh, it's going to be a good night. Gosh, I thought the tube was quite how busy this is. It's Green Street. And the extras. The road that gosh, millions of people must have walked down. Everyone's going off Upton Park now. Can just go off? Wings Fish Bar is certainly a place that I'm going to miss when we move to Stratford. Always a good portion from Queen's. So, yeah, this is the usual programme that I go to. But look, they've got really up market today with their gazebo. So, this is it. I was hoping at quarter to eight I'd be going into the uh, into the ground to watch the game but it's quarter to eight now and it's delayed kickoff till half past eight which is really disappointing. Man United, you know it's going to be traffic, what are you doing? They should have been here on time so it's really disappointing that I'm not seeing um, us playing right now and got to wait 45 minutes but I've decided I'm going to go into the ground now, soak up a bit in the atmosphere, it seems rammed now already and then just see what happens so come on your irons. So here we go, I'm in the ground now, I've got my farewell bowling shirt on, the atmosphere is really starting to build up now.
this is the final game at Upton Park. Come on you Ayo, get in there, 1-0 West Ham, oh yeah! So first half done. 1-0 to West Ham, should have been 2, should have been 3, with Carroll and Haya both going close, but hey, it's been a great atmosphere, a really great send-off on the bowling ground.